Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new video and uh, a brand new episode of uh, the martial artist's journey. Now, if you haven't watched the last episode, I really recommend that you do. But too long didn't watch our friend Beast here, an empire peasant or laborer who just got bored of being, you know, like the absolute scum of society, the lowest rank uh, of citizen he is, and decided to, you know, put his fate into his hands uh, quite literally because he uh, decided to become a martial artist living day to day by the use of his might and his fists. In this uh, episode, he is here in the world's end and he has heard from other drifters and uh, travelers that there is a, um, a martial artist village in like the southern part of the map, like around the um the empire uh, down here, like somewhere around the high bone fields. And basically, that's and his next lead towards becoming a better martial artist and growing stronger. But first, do you want an easy way to record your gaming sessions and highlights of all the cool plays you pull off in games? Well, it has never been easier with today's sponsor, Outplayed. With Outplayed, you can just set it up and it records everything automatically while you play. You can choose to record an entire session or just the highlights. What are the highlights? Well, you choose. With Outplayed, you can pick whatever moments for it to automatically record as they happen in the game. You can then trim the video as you like and easily share it on social platforms with the click of a button. Outplayed supports a big variety of games and the list is only getting bigger. Use my link in the description to download Outplayed for free. This guy's goal is to become so powerful that he could take down any foe and take whatever he wants from anyone at any point. So don't ever feel bad for him. He is not exactly a good person. <laughs> He's basically like chaotic neutral. He he does whatever he wants. He takes whatever he wants. And he's just trying to become stronger so that no one else can force him to do anything or like to submit. So yeah, he has uh, rested and he has bought some supplies as you can see here. Some food and everything. He bought some gear for traveling, a backpack and everything. And uh, he's uh, ready to head out. He will be making... Oh man, that's a long journey through a bunch of like dangerous stuff. But hey, it's gonna make him grow and it's gonna help him become a better martial artist. Let's move. A lot of people ask me about what was my inspiration for this character. Okay, I'll tell you. Uh, my character... Who is that? Is that my next... Uh... He's a free trader. Is that my next train sparring partner? I think it is. But yeah, the inspiration for this uh, character is... Uh, it's you from uh, Holy Land. I highly recommend that manga. It's about a kid who, you know, was uh, facing bullying at school and just didn't feel like he belonged. And one day he found a um, book about boxing and just start doing it for fun he was start training at home and before he knew it he had the most destructive right hook ever imagined but i'll leave you with that and i won't explain any further so it's a mix of that character and um tokita oma from uh king and ashura as so those of you who have seen the the show will already have figured that out considering how this guy looks like so uh, yeah that's the inspiration an injured check uh drifter well she's a better challenger than that guy she's definitely stronger than him let me follow you instead then all right there's no one around let's fight Ooh. all right all right she not a single hit was landed during that entire exchange beautiful oh my god the beast is gonna l learn so much from this all right and another and another? Hey! Hmm. You don't really need two weapons, do you? Let me take one off of you. I'll take that money as well. Now let me heal you so that you go on your way. And Marie, from the bottom of my heart, thank you, for you have made me stronger. Free trader, you've been spared. Bye, <laughs> Honestly, I'll just fight other drifters when I can. Uh, no need to. They're, they're not a faction. And they're just other people like me with no like affiliation so i'm not you know making any factions mad at me if i'm fighting them would you look at that mike another drifter well i could do with a little uh, sparring mikey let's go Oof. all right all right a little hammer kick all right kicking and fighting him while he was down all right nice dodge Ooh. okay he's the beast has unlocked some new moves Oh yeah, oh yeah, for sure. 
He's showing off at this point. Ooh, I could take that saber to sell. I'm gonna heal him so he doesn't die. Here you go, Mikey. From the bottom of my heart, thank you, for you have made me stronger. Also, I forgot to say, but uh, before you ask about mods, they're in the description. What on earth? What? It's giving me a little mini heart attack when I... What? These guys have a tamed beak thing? What? My life's biggest bra moments. Do you see now? Do you see now why the beast has chosen to leave his past behind and like seek to explore the world for what it is? He would have never seen something like this before. My god. We have safely arrived in the hub. What an amazing space. I just love this uh, place. It feels like home, you know. It's so cozy. <laughs> It's so cozy and so welcoming and inviting. I just love it. I just love it. It's home. We'll chill here until the morning. Um, maybe we'll find someone to fight during the night. Starving mercenary. Yeah, the hub has seen better days, hasn't it? All right, it's almost morning. And I was hoping that someone in the bar would be itching for a fight. But no, I think the hub has been completely taken over by mercenaries. But I just spotted a vagrant outside that we can talk to. Let's go check it out. Tambra, her name is. The hell are you looking at, eh? A dead man if you keep pushing me. Hey, hey, no need to misgender her. <laughs> let's see how cocky you are after I'm done giving you a bashing. Yeah, let's see it. Ooh. Immediately she spins for 16 damage. 38. Oh. All right. Nice block. Ooh. Teleports behind her. Nothing personnel. Boom, boom. One, two, th and, and a spinning fist. Into a flying Superman uh, punch, and down she goes. All right, we sold the swords. We got the we got the medicine that we needed, and uh, let's keep going. We're about to enter the swamp. If you've played Kenshi, you know what's in the swamp. But we have to. All right, we have to. I'm not making like uh, not turning around the swamp. It's gonna take way too long. So we'll just head right in. We're not afraid of anything. Oh God, here it is, the swamp. Yes. The rivers here are completely red. Is it blood? We don't know. Right, let's be careful here. You can't really spot uh, enemies until you're way like in their face. So uh, let's stick to the road and hopefully we'll be fine. Such a beautifully like eerie and creepy space, you know? All the trees and everything. It's it's quite uh, mesmerizing, not gonna lie. I just realized we're literally doing like an arc in an anime where the main character hears of like a school or something or like a uh, somewhere where to hone his skills and they're like doing that whole like journey arc to get there. <laughs> Ooh, blood spiders, you see that? It would be wise to avoid them. No need to fight these. I got nothing to gain and everything to lose. They literally devour you if, if they kill you. So it's not like other enemies that'll just loot you and leave you be. These just straight up eat you i'm pretty sure uh the swamp is populated by a gang that is added from a mod uh and the gang is called i, I think like the arachne ninjas or something like that those guys they mean business i've seen them before and i've seen their armors but i haven't really met them and i'm hoping that i don't there goes the scream again that's terrifying. Wait, that's a camp right there. Which camp is that? Let's get a bit closer. Arachne Stalker? The Arachnids. Those are the guys I was talking about earlier. Have they not spotted me? No shot. No way. Ar Arachne Weaver. Ooh, look how cool those weapons are, man. And I'm pretty sure, yeah, they, they actually, like, um... They have spiders as pets. <laughs> the blood spiders. I don't know how they tamed those uh, creatures, but yeah, they, they do. That person, an arachne stalker, they have no legs. That is terrifying. Yeah, it's pretty terrifying. You know what? They haven't given me any trouble yet. Better leave before I actually get into trouble with them. So let's just leave, all right? Let's just go. We're not strong enough, nor is it worth it to fight those guys, all right? I think we're out. Yeah, oof, we're out of this swamp. Let's go. Let's go. Look how cloudy it is in that uh, place. Look, I thought it was going to be harder than that, but uh, hey. Whoa, what the? An Arachne stalker? You actually followed me? Wait, did they follow me from this? Dude, that is so cool. I'm going to draw them out of the swamp for a bit, and then we fight. If I can beat him and steal his legs. <laughs> <laughs> no, it won't just be hilarious. It would also be very profitable for me. Right, this is a good spot to fight, isn't it? Let's do it then, shall we? Oh, no. Oh, no. 
Nice dodge. All right. All right. Ooh, okay. All right, all right, all right. Wait, 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 wait. Get back here. Get back here. They are unironically... What the hell is wrong with you people? What do you mean? I can't catch up with her to, to fight her. Ah, uh, it has to be like a specific attack. Ooh, like that, all right. Come on, beast. <laughs> My God. Ooh, okay, okay. Like that, man. Like, why can't you keep attacking like that? All right. Oh my god. Oh, that's Arachne slave. Is that what you have been after? Why does the the vagrant have the same helmet as them? I guess it's like their way of branding uh their hostages and stuff like that. I'll free you. Don't worry. I'll free you. That was a nice dodge. Ooh. 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 The menace. The beast. <laughs> but hey, we actually got to, to meet an uh, Aragne um, bandit or whatever. Let's heal uh, that person. I'll unlock their shackles. You'll be all right. You'll be all right. Just sit tight. Let me... All right then. Just good luck, I guess. Man, what a fight that was. That was pretty profitable, though. That, that's going to sell for a lot. All right, let's get out of these swamps. It's dangerous in here. It's really dangerous. Someone's getting eaten alive, man. You saw that? No, please. Yeah, someone's getting eaten alive. Let's get out of here. <laughs> I hope it's not that slave that I just freed. Well, didn't free, but just help. Oh, 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 oh. Hello, 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 hello. Blood spiders. All right, let's uh, let's not get get caught here. Horrors beyond your imagination. That's what's in the swamp. If anyone ever asks you. A market. All right, let's go check it out. It's the market over there. I wonder what market. Never mind. Never mind. I see the cages. I understand what market, is, what type of market it is. I hope no one there messes with us, and I don't think they will. But uh, yeah, this is a good stop for us. It's almost uh, getting uh, to nighttime. Do they have a bar in here that I can uh, stay at? Let's see here. Used clothing shop. I'll check it out. Why not? Discovered hidden village. Ooh, that dude. That might be the village that we're after. The martial artist village that we're after. We'll go check it out after like uh, spending the night here. I don't want to rock up on the village during the night. A bar. There's the bar. Let's go to the bar then. Yeah, this is messed up what they're doing to the people here. But hey, the only way to resist this kind of people is to become strong like the beast is trying to do that way no one can force you to anything hello the beast answers to no one i i got some items for you all right we'll find the spot to chill in do you have any beds they're all taken what about the other bar all taken whatever i'll just chill until this headache is gone. Just chill in the corner here. Like the edgy man that I am. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Something's happening. Yo, what the? A bunch of monks have just entered. Yo, liberating prisoners? What? Are these people from that village? Yo, 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 yo. Okay, Beast has to go out to witness what happens here. They are here to liberate prisoners. Oh my god. They're just straight up, what is gonna happen? I'll go take like a vantage point to, to watch the, the insanity. Take things as they are. Punch when you have to punch. Kick when you have to kick. Okay, it has started. Oh, he never even saw it coming. I didn't see it. Yo, yo, I'm pretty sure it's a glitch or like something wrong with my mod list. But that monk just like did that ninja move where, oh, you didn't see me attack and just destroyed that guy's leg immediately. They're coming up. They're coming up. Oh, they're already here. Oh, they just punched him off the tower and they jumped off. All right. Where's the monk in red? The monk in red. All right. They're up here. Watch the monk in red. Their moves are insane. Look. Let the monk in red take it. Just weaved in 120 damage just like that. Oh my god. They they took that person's arm off. Okay, okay. The monk in red. A dodge. Oh, do you see that? They don't even like they don't have an animation for it. Oh! Oh! Again! Again it happens. They just get instantly crippled. Do it again. End his career! Oh! She's so fast that you don't even see the hit coming out. Oh my god. Uh, and she wandered off. Follow her. Follow her. Beast, follow and learn. There was someone in the... Someone snuck up the crossbows and, and wanted to use them. One-shotted. My goodness. Okay, this guy's going ham on them. 
Come on, activate your sharing gun. Just destroy him. Behind you. Careful. Ooh! A dodge into a one shot. My god. My goodness. My goodness. She just one shot him. I need to become that person. My goodness. My goodness. My god. Why can't I be that cool? Go, go, go. Follow them. Follow that person. She just ate. Oh! She cut off his... In <gasps> She cut off his leg in one shot. Barely sustained any damage to. Oh my god. Alright, look. There's a lot of projectiles going around. So I'm just gonna like hug a wall and stay there and watch. Ooh. It's insane. That is insane. I can't get over how cool this concept is. Even though I'm pretty sure like this is a glitch. But like they, they are stuttering. And the punches just come out. Look. Ooh. <laughs> Do it to him. Boom. Do it to him again. Boom. Do it to him again. My god, that's so cool. Look at this little, like, look at this screenshot right here. <laughs> that worked out so in such a cool manner for her. She dodged this guy's arrow and unintentionally dodged, like, someone's turret shot. And now she's going for them. And now he's going to die. There's already a monk here, like, wrecking them. My goodness, how much dexterity does that monk have? Not even that much. But they're attacking so fast. Okay, the red monk is destroying them again. Oh no, the turrets. The harpoons, I mean, yeah. Careful. Don't get harpooned. They're like slowly disintegrating them, man. Ah, she's eating too many. She's eating too many shots. Yo! I cannot get over how cool this is. There's a bunch of outlaws, empire peasants starting trouble inside of here while everything's going on outside. <laughs> what the hell's happening, man? No, they've captured most of the monks. My god. Uh, hold on, is the red monk captured? Don't tell me they've captured the red monk. How? How could they contain such power? Also, what was that in, in the monk's head? I can't find the red monk. Wait, are these her sandals? Must be because they're specialist grade. She must have been captured then, but where is she? Well, it doesn't matter, but we just learned two things. Two very important things. The monks are against the slavers, so, that, so if we join them, we're going to be against slavers. Which I don't really mind. And the second thing is that they're insanely overpowered. The beast can achieve his dream of becoming so powerful that he, no one could defy him. Let's go and seize it. Where's that hidden village? Right there. All right, let's go. Oh, that's it right there. This is the village. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Immense power is within our grasp just over this mountain. I can see it. I can smell it. The ability to one punch anyone it's here stop drifter uh-huh uh-huh uh -huh. i'm right here gear bag check this town forbids drugs and illegal items yeah you can check my gear it's all good acceptable you may pass to our ancient village brother wait this person also has the gem thingy third eye whatever pretty sure that's gonna be like a hat that adds stats insane stats if i can get that gem that'd be huge me 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 that is this my god they've they've made me but as a martial artist. Me? Never mind. Please leave me alone. <laughs> Guys, don't ask me to 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 uh, recruit him, alright? Look, all the guys in red have the third eye thing. That is insane. Also, that guy looks like his arm was amputated and reattached. Skull reference? Full Metal Brotherhood reference? What? Okay, hey, fellow human. You are not human. <laughs> Shut up. All right. What is this? Lotus. Uh, toughness of 30. Mm, you can train your toughness up here. But they're probably going to be mad at me. All right. Let's see here. What do we have? A monk loath shop. Let's go check it out. Ooh. What's this then? All right. All right. Monk Grandmaster. That's where I got it from. 
Are these grandmasters? They're, he's an elder. All right, well, whatever. Let's go into the HQ and check. Greetings, brothers. All right, let's get in. Yo! What? Who is this guy? And after many moons, another human drifter has come to our home, humble home. Bows, I want to get stronger. I wish to learn from your exalted martial arts. Yes. And so it is. Doesn't beat around the bush. A virtuous heart does not bend to material things, but it climbs onto heaven's dome. Fear not the pain, but dispel suffering. Please enlighten me. Our village always welcomes your kind of spirit. We preach freedom and healthy life. If you wish to join us, you will become enemies against those who are against those values. Yep, you're gonna be against slavers. I loathe those who shackle, uh, shackles freedom and discriminate other races. I am an open-minded human. Relations with slave hunters decreased by minus 100. Joins hands in Mundra Gasso Seal. You may be always welcome. Blessings. You are no longer drifter. Man hunters by minus 100%. Eh, uh, you know what? Whatever. As a new monk initiated, you may follow your elders. Outside is plagued with danger. Grow strong, my child. I am an honorary member of this monk school now. <laughs> A monk martial arts school, huh? Our theories of the etern e e eternal are as valuable as, as those which a chick which has not broken its way through its shell might form of the outside world. Okay. Uh, gives me a bunch of philosophical stuff, refuses to elaborate, leaves. Also, I just realized that little peacock thingy. Those are hands. Those are all hands. <laughs> My dude has got 147 martial arts. What? He's got a dexterity of 223. What? Welcome back, child. Grand ancestor. I wish to learn more and grow stronger. Please enlighten me. Smiles warmly. Step by step, my child. Life is sacred, but this world is harsh. If you wish to climb, mm -hmm, you must deliver some animal skins. Then put them one day on sunlight and moonlight. Okay, so he wants me to hunt some animals. Well, that's gonna have to wait until next episode, but hold on, hold on. There is something that I'm super curious about. Would he one-shot me if I fight him? We're gonna pop a save real quick, and we're gonna try. What the? Who is this guy? Kazan Ancestor Fire? Sheesh. Dude, these guys are insane. Okay, I'm gonna pop a save, and I'm gonna try to fight him, alright? Alright, here goes nothing. <laughs> uh what the yo 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 i attacked him i like he sensed my intentions my leg immediately disappears from under me what is this power let's let's try again let's see what he does again oh beast is dead 300 damage beast is just straight up dead at first he just crippled me so that i may reconsider but then he just straight up killed me <laughs> my god well it seems like uh we have found our path to obtaining absolute power you've seen that that guy can hit for 300 damage immediately you just you don't even see it coming your leg is just no longer there that's the kind of power that the beast is after he wants to completely dominate his enemies he wants to be the next step of human evolution, he wants to transcend the level of godhood. Even though he's gonna have to put an act to fool these monks into giving him this absolute power, he's gonna bear with it until he achieves what he wants. It looks our journey begins here to become the ultimate life form the strongest man on earth but yeah that's gonna be it for this episode if you want to see more of the beast's journey into becoming a, a god of martial arts make sure to leave a like and a comment down below letting me know if you have any ideas they're always welcome your feedback is is always welcome i always listen to it and uh, it matters to me a lot so yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video as much as i enjoyed making it and i'll see you guys in the next one much love Bye bye